the morning of June 30th, 1908, the sky over Siberia's Tunguska Tiger split open. A blue-white fireball flashed on the horizon. Seconds later, a colossal airburst slammed the forest flat. 2,150 square kilometers of trees went down. 80 million trunks felled in the same direction. The shock was felt hundreds of kilometers away. Instruments jumped. And that night, Europe reported unnaturally bright skies. People said they could read newspapers outdoors. On the ground, there was no crater. The blow had happened in the air. A 50 to 60 meter space rock broke apart before impact, unleashing tens of megatons of energy. When scientists finally reached the site in 1927, they found a single haunting image. Trees scorched and laid out like compass needles. Rings cut in the same year. Tunguska was the greatest cosmic near-miss of the modern era. A few hours later, and farther west, it could have erased St. Petersburg from the map. The lesson is stark. Some of Earth's most devastating events never touch the ground. Sometimes the sky itself turns to day.